Now, a vegan in Perth has been cooking up a storm with her neighbours. She has basically taken them all the way to the Supreme Court, demanding that they stop smoking, the kids stop bouncing balls and playing basketball, and they even stop backyard barbecues. Now, Nikki, Scylla Carden <laughs> lost the case, but she is vowing to continue this legal battle. Um, what are your thoughts here? We live in suburbia, we fire up the barbie, the kids play ball in the backyard, and you have a problem with that? Exactly. I think this is ridiculous, and I'm glad the courts have come down on her and basically thrown this out. I mean, we live in increasingly dense living situations, a lot of us living on top of each other in apartments and all the rest of it. There has to be give and take. I mean, you know, barbecue smoke, it wasn't even red meat they were barbecuing, it was fish. And kids playing, there's nothing more joyous than the sound of children playing. I'm really glad that the courts have said, Sorry, madam, this is ridiculous. We're throwing this out. Yeah, I mean, Brett, loud music in a rave party would have been far more neighbourly, don't you think? Yeah, yeah that's <laughs> right. Barking uh, dog. <laughs> and kids playing basketball. I don't understand what the problem is here. This is just life living next to people. In fact, I've had neighbours next door maliciously barbecuing and not inviting me over, and oh. I think that's <laughs> outrageous. Do no, they cook fish? My next door neighbour is a chef, so when he's barbecuing, oh. I'm the one around there with a bottle of wine saying, is there room for one more? Of course. And what does he, what does he cook up? I mean, is it to your liking? Oh, yeah. He is a, he's an excellent <laughs> chef, in fact. Uh, we're going away with him next weekend, so I'll oh, let you know how it goes. But no, it really, seriously, this is what, what neighbours do. And if they're not doing anything offensive that's keeping you up at three in the morning, then live and let live. Because the flip side is there are plenty of people saying that, you know, we're living more isolated lives, mm. we're not getting to know our neighbours, we're not even saying hello when we put the bins out. Mm, I mean, what mm. does this woman want? And these barbecuers are being very good because apparently they've shifted the barbecue and they've told their kids not to play basketball, so they are trying to do the neighbourly thing. Mm. Imagine that. Don't play basketball, <laughs> don't laugh, don't yes, talk. Yes. Unbelievable.